lenses. A lens is a transparent medium that has at least one curved surface. It is used for changing the direction of a beam of light. You are aware that lenses are used to rectify the defects of vision in camera, in projectors, in telescopes and in microscopes. The lenses used to rectify short sight and long sight. The defects of vision are of different types. Let us now see why these lenses are different. A lens is regarded as a combination of a large number of very small prisms with a very small glass slab at the center. The prisms in the lens can be arranged in two different ways as shown here. A lens refracts the light incident on it, that is, it either converges or diverges the ray of light depending on the arrangement of the prisms. Let us now try to understand the convergent and divergent action of a lens on a parallel beam of light. In the first type of arrangement, all the prisms in the upper half have their base downwards and the prisms in the lower half have their base upwards. Hence, any parallel beam of light incident on the upper half of the lens gets deviated downwards and the light incident on the lower half gets deviated upwards. The central part of the lens allows the light to pass without any deviation as it behaves like a glass slab. This type of lens concentrates a beam of light to a single point. In the second type of arrangement, the prisms are arranged in such a way that the upper half have their bases upwards while those in the lower half have their bases downwards. Here the parallel rays of light incident on the upper half of the lens get deviated upwards. The rays of light incident on the lower half of the lens get deviated downwards. The rays of light incident on the central part of the lens pass through it without any deviation as it behaves like a glass slab. Based on this, lenses are classified as convex and concave lenses. A lens that is thicker in the middle than at the edges is known as a convex or converging lens. Whereas the lens that is thinner at the middle than at the edges is known as concave lens or diverging lens. Generally, the lenses are represented as shown here. Let us now see how a flower looks when viewed through concave and convex lenses. We observe that the flower when viewed through the convex lens looks bigger and brighter as the lens is able to concentrate the beam of light on a surface. Whereas the same flower when viewed through a concave lens appears smaller in size as the concave lens diverges the beam of light. This is because the nature of refraction in the case of a convex lens and a concave lens is different. The flowchart shown here gives the different types of convex and concave lenses. Did you know? The word lens is derived from the Latin word lenticula. Lenticula is a lentil. A lentil seed is flat and round and it bulges out at the middle just like a biconvex lens. Bengal gram and black gram are examples of lentils.